had to do this part offline. I had to do this part off YouTube. So, yeah. We're just going to resume. Oops. Did you break another cup? Oh, really? Go, no refill for you. Shh. Well, now I got to take this call and leave my breakfast. Hey, where is my party? You called it. He's off to go bust some skaters. You're a dick. Don't slap me, bitch. Take your fight club outside. He started it. I'm finishing. Trevor and Justin must be in love. You predicted a cockroach on the jukebox? I pledge allegiance to Max and the power for which she stands. This isn't a toy, Chloe. I do have to be careful how I use it. Screw that! Of course it's a toy. The best toy ever? You can bang anyone with no strings attached, rewind time, and boom! It's like it never happened! Grow up. Maybe you made a move on me and I would never know. Yes, that's what I did. You can rewind time, Max. That's fucking insane. We have to play. I don't have time. Hey, Corey, if I invite you, you to a party, would you join? Uh, check out your nose. Too much blow? Hey, are you okay? Too much excitement. See what happens when we hook up again? Then, let's go to one of my secret lairs and fully test your power. You need a sidekick to guide you. Okay, girl wonder. Show me the way to Chloe's cave. No thanks. <laughs> okay, Supergirl, let's go to my secret place. Don't even answer. We have places to go and go to do. Come on, before Mom starts some more shit, let's bail. It's Kate Marsh from Blackwell. Big whoop. You don't call me once in five years, and now you're all over some biatch you see every day at school? I see how you roll. So uh, go okay, ahead, Luke. chat up Kate Marsh from Blackwell. I've got other people to hang out with, too. You are rude. Hey, Kate. What's up? Please, don't let your best friend get in the way. You okay? I promise, Kate. I won't forget. I swear. Just do your homework and not stress. I really don't think we should go into this right now. I'll call you later, okay? Thanks, Max. If you'd rather chill with Kate, please, go ahead. You are ridiculous. I'm chilling with you, okay? For now. Let's rock. Sucks that Chloe and Joyce got into an argument. Kate is in my name also. Please join if I invite you. going to get pissed at me this week. That depends on you and how well you do in this phase of the test. Welcome to American Rust, my home away from No hell. thanks. Raw Don't and type. rough. It suits you. Max, do you know how awesome this is? I get my best friend back and she's also super sized? We don't know for how long. Exactly why it's time to have fun. You know you can go. David might be a douche, but you did steal his gun. Is everybody armed in Arcadia Bay now? Only the ones who... Cool. Okay, guys, I'm going to be right back. I'm going to go get some more lemonade, and I'll be back soon. Bye! My bad. Really, I just got here.
I'm back! Finally! <laughs> you shouldn't be like Step Dildo until now. I'm I had to go get some more lemonade. Che. You are the revolution, Max. So we should figure out how to best use and abuse your power with a test. <sighs> Yuck. You are so cute. You haven't changed a bit. <laughs> okay. Okay, let's do this. Can you find five bottles while I prep the shooting range? Beer and guns? Nice combo. You can handle it. Now go find us five bottles, pretty please. I found that bottle. Wait, she said what? Oh, gross. So disturbing to see old syringes on the ground. Gross. What game is this, by the way? This is... Oh, I'm glad you asked. This is, um... This looks like Life a is Strange. For Chloe and Rachel. So Rachel did go to a vortex club party. This is Life this is, is Strange. I want to die. Oh gosh. Jeez. Who wrote this? I don't know. Oh, there you are, little bottle. Trying to play hide and seek. Hello, bottle number one. Four more to go. Is it free? Yes, it's free. Ouch. Oh. I can't see Chloe playing with makeup. That kind of hurts. This is, uh, Life is Strange. And it is, is it no free. Huh? Wait, what did you say? Is it multiplayer? No, it is not multiplayer. It is a one-on-one -on -one game where you could just play by yourself. And happens to be beyond repair. Rest in peace. Happens to be uh, my dad. He actually gave me the whole. I wonder how many generations of fashion went through that washing. Life joinable. My Dang dad YouTube. gave me the. My dad may. My dad ordered the whole episodes. Ooh, I have three bottles left. So yeah. Three bottles left. I wonder if Chloe thinks about her father when she looks at all these smashed up cars. Well. Now we need to find one more wow. bottle. That looks exactly like the same dough from my tornado vision. What? That dough is the perfect photo op. It's so quiet and primordial out here. Listen, I'm still late nighting you. Please join. Nah, thanks. Oh, there's a deer. <gasps> no! Come back here! Oh, man. I scared away a deer. I didn't mean to. I wanted to take a foot of Inviting the deer. You. Do what? What'd you say? Alright, I need to go find a- I need to go find... But I wanted to take a picture of the deer, that was sweet. I need to find another bottle. I've got one more bottle. I can't believe I just saw a deer and... 
It was so cute. I forgot to take a picture of the deer though. We need to find one more bottle, but I don't know where it is. Julie. No thanks, I'm good. I don't want to go that way. Oh. Really? Okay. Those shells look fresh. Why? Cause I'm playing a game. Did you just say those shells? Oh, gross. So disturbing to see old syringes on the ground. <laughs> I need to find one more bottle. Uh. -oh. The Bigfoots were here. <laughs> I don't know how to play. You don't know how to play. Play what? This game? <laughs> I didn't know how to play this game either until I learned. They really were best. Oh, there's a photo. That could have been me yes. instead of Rachel. Rachel songs. I wonder Rachel? if Chloe would ever make me a mixtape. Ouch. <laughs> I need to find one more bottle. Really, and not that smart, Corey. Oh, hush. <laughs> I need to find one more bottle, but I don't know where it is. Every car has its own tale and history. Hmm, ew. Gross. Uh-uh. Those shells look fresh. <laughs> You're not smart. Train. If you find the last bottle, will you join? Nope. Aww, poor oh, there's a baby doll. They left you here all alone. That's just sad. Oh, poor thing. They left you here all alone. Oh. My poor baby. Where's that bone? I bet I could get on the boat from a higher location. There's a bottle! I found it! But how do I get to it? No, you're rude. I could use this board Not as a bridge. Sad. Doesn't look too heavy. But how do I get to it? Oh. Hmm. Huh. I could use this board as a bridge. Doesn't look too heavy. Way heavier than I thought. Ugh.
cool. At least not everything is broken around here. Three down, two more to go. Talk about finding a bottle in a haystack. We have two more left. I don't hear a frog. Please join, please. No, thank you. I'm busy. Quit asking me that. Nope, I don't want to go there. <sighs> We're going to get caught by the police. Now where did she go? Ooh. Thanks for the tip. I'm the only one talking in chat cause you're being rude. <laughs> Whatever. That train scares me. There's a train. I don't want to go that way. She almost got ran over by a train. Um, I don't know where any more bottles will be, but we gotta find two more. Go that way. We gotta find two more, and I don't can't find it. Where is she at? No, I mean find bottles. Maybe in an old refrigerator. Ooh, there's a refrigerator right here. But how do I get to it? It's not a refrigerator. I wonder how many generations of fashion went through that washing machine. I have a question whatever happened to Minecraft and why don't you join like Grey's parties or anyone else's parties that actually invite yo? So sad to look at a grounded boat. I wonder who owned that and where they are now. You pasted one. I have to find dirty ass bottles while you chill? Not fair. I have to prep the range, crybaby? And I've been tripping hard about where you got this rewind power. From God? Or the gods? So, bow. We can make the world bow. Are you ready for that? No way. I still don't even know how my power works. Or for how long. Dude, you fuck shit up, you rewind, you fix it. Drop the mic, boom. Spin, rinse, and repeat. I'm just altering time and space. Oh yeah, and history. <laughs> no biggie. You already altered history by saving my life, smartass. Let's see what else you can do. Wait, I passed one? Where did I pass one at? 
How do you know I passed one? Why are you ignoring people? Where? No, I, I'm not ignoring people. You where? You person. said I passed one, but where? Did I? Did I really pass one? No, I didn't. I didn't pass one. No way. I totally remember going there when I was a kid. I love the Hush Puppies. Now the sign is just Arcadia Bay junk. Oh, I love I Hush Puppies. Oh. <laughs> Alright, tell me where this, um, tell me where the, uh, bottle is. Cause you said I passed one and I don't know where it is. Why did you tell me I passed one? I did not pass one. It was by the old fridge. What old fridge? This one? There's two fridges. Oh! It was at the top. Thank you for helping. Stupid bottle. Well, I broke it. Yes, I thought I saw one. Look what we have here. A cute little bottle for the taking. Maybe I can use this to reach the bottle. There we go. Maybe I can use this to reach the bottle. There you go. Now you took it. Good job. <laughs> Thank you so much for helping. Go. I've got one more bottle left. And I'm not sure where it's going to be. No. No. What does that mean? Oh, that was rude. Where's this last one gonna be at? I have no idea. I could look back up here. Even though I already looked up here. Huh? See one of the fridges, but wasn't sure which one. It was this one. <gasps> oh, there's a squirrel. There's a squirrel. I'm thinking if the squirrel's trying to help me. Reach it. I know there's a bonfire spot where people party around here. I'm reading the chat. Reddit. 
Okay. There's another squirrel. I have a feeling that squirrel was trying to help me. Was that squirrel trying to help me? Also, if you join, I can see your screen, and plus, I don't have to talk. I know there's a bonfire spot where people party around here. With typing. What in the world am I doing? There's an old bus. Aww. This was an old school punk shirt. There's a fridge. I just got a phone just now. You did? Cool. Alright, where's this last bottle at? Beyond repair. Rest in peace. <laughs> Where's this last stinking bottle I'm at? So sad to look at a grounded boat. I wonder who owned that and where they are now. Did I pass the bottle? No idea where it is. What is this thing? Come on, Corey, you've got to find another one. I see a cute butterfly. All this rusted metal makes me feel serene. Am I morbid or just God? Bro. What? You called me bro, what? Bro. No, I don't want to go there. What? No way. No way what? I know there's a bonfire spot where people party around here. Bonfire? Where's the bonfire? I just got it from. Oh, poor thing. Yeah, 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 I know, you told me. But where is the bonfire? Do y'all know where the bonfire is? Because I have no idea. Alright guys, I'll be right back. I gotta go to the party. Oh. Please join and I can help you. Oh. oh, really? Where's the bonfire at? Uh, help me. I prepare the shooting range while you look for some bottles. <laughs> Thank you. 
Yes. I know there's a bonfire spot where people party around here. Got a bottle in her hand. <laughs> That's my Chloe. Down the bond. I know there's a spot where people party around here. All right, does anybody see a bonfire? Have Phyllis just over there in the woods. All right, let's go to the other side. Is it over here? There's got to be a bonfire over here. Is there? I don't see anything. Where's the bonfire at? What? Are you kidding me? <sighs> you guys, I don't know where the bonfire is and I can't I find it. A bonfire spot where people party around here. Where is it? Um you dummy. This was an old school punk shack. Yeah, 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 yeah. We know. But where's the stupid bonfire at? I don't know where it is. I can't find it.
bonfires is bonfire gonna be hard. People party around here. Well, where is it at, stupid head? Nope, I don't want to go there. <laughs> but where was it at? I don't see no stinking bonfire. This place is stupid. I want to get out of here. There ain't no stupid bonfire. This place is dumb. What was that? Oh. <laughs> Alright, where is this bonfire at? Help me! Shooting range while you look for some bottles. <laughs> Jerk, I hate you. She ain't helping me, you guys. There ain't no bonfire. She's just telling a lie. Where is this thing at? It's squirrel. Come here, squirrel. I don't know where the bonfire is. I'm looking all over the place. I know there's a bonfire spot where people party around here. But where? But where at? I can't find it. Although this junkyard is a dive, I see why Chloe hangs here. She's a steampunk. It actually feels like Chloe and I are kids again. We're hiding out and plotting our future. Despite all the chaos and bullshit, I feel so giddy hanging out with her again. So happy. Like we've both gone back in time. <laughs> Okay, I need a look. Guys, I have no idea where the bonfire is. And this makes it so hard. a bonfire spot where people party around here. Keep saying that, but I don't find one, you idiot. I'm talking to her. I'm not talking to y'all. I'm talking to, um, Max. She keeps saying there's a bonfire near her, but there ain't no bonfire. I don't see anything. There ain't no bonfire. Rachel songs. I wonder if Chloe would ever make me a mixtape. This is a popular party pit. Oh, it's right there. <laughs> Guys, I what? looked in this area this and I just didn't part. find it. Oh my god. I have to rewind now. I gotta run.
Do I have the bottle? This bottle over there? Or do I have it? I think I have it. Alright, now we need to go back to... Now we need to go back to... Her. Boom. Thanks, Max. Wait, one more for the road. You're serious about this. We're gonna shoot all these bottles without wasting a single bullet. Max, you have to help me aim. Show me the way, Max. I need to see you shoot first. Show me the way, Max. Aim a bit to your left. I'm on it. Lame! Hey, it... Fault. Show me the way, Max. Aim a bit to the right. Sir, yes, sir. Oh, yes! Did you see that shit, Max? Duh. That was so fucking cool! Now for the second bottle. Now, Max, where do I aim? You're on target. Pull the trigger. Now, Max, where do I aim? Aim a bit to the right. Beep, beep. Laser tracking on. Now, Max, where do I aim? Aim slightly above. Right between the eyes. Watch out, Nathan. Now that is fun. Let's pump up the volume and find me another target. I want to get creative here. Give me something to shoot, Max. Let's take out this wheel rim on your left. Taking out the wheel rim now? Hella yes! Nice shooting, Tex. Now that's what I'm talking about. Satisfied? <laughs> like, never. So I want one more uber cool trick shot. How about using that junker for a target now? Dude, I need a target before I shoot. How about aiming for the left tire? Adios, spinning wheel of death. Uber cool. I cannot believe this is for reals. My best friend is a superhero! Now it's your turn to bust a cap. I don't know. Max, your nose. Damn. I don't feel so super. Max! <laughs> That's loud! That was loud. Max! You okay? Wait, what happened? Max was bleeding. You freaked me out there. Do you feel any better now? She freaked me out too. A little. Thanks for helping me. Just give me a minute. Too much action for Arcadia? Maybe not enough. This is kind of fun. <laughs> Scary and stupid, but fun. Let me know when you feel okay. God, this power really messes with my head. God, I feel normal again. I better go chat up Chloe. Okay. Looks like you're ready to lock and load. I don't know about this. Are you afraid of getting in trouble? Oh, boo-hoo, Max is afraid. I know you can handle this, and I'm here to guide you. Make me proud, sister. Nah. 
Hey, it's Thelma and Louise. Or is it Bonnie and Clyde? Excuse us, Frank. Oh, sorry, Chloe. Don't let me get in the way of your bonding. I heard the gunshots and the breaking glass. It's cute that you're playing with guns. Just like me at your age. We're not anything alike, man. We both need money. In fact, you need it so bad, you owe me a shitload, don't you, Chloe? Huh? You'll get your money. Don't they all say that? You know, even when they're broke and acting tough? What are you hiding there, girly? Let me see. Where did you get that bracelet? A friend, and it's none of your goddamn business. You're my business now, That's and I... Rachel's bracelet! Why the fuck are you wearing her bracelet? Calm yourself, all right? It was a gift. No, it wasn't! You stole that shit! Give it to me right now, asshole! You better step back before you regret it, girl. I mean it. You want me to cut you, bitch? Please. Please, step back. You're kidding. Put that down. Come on, girly. Shoot me. Don't. Ah, oh, Christ. You're more like Abbott and Costello. <laughs> nice piece. Consider God, this I just saw alone. Thanks. You have until Friday to pay me, or I'll track you down with this interest. Have a good play, kids. You really stood your ground. I freaked. I don't like guns. It'll be hard to keep Nathan off my ass. My step shit will have his other gun sealed in an electrified bunker by now. Sorry, Chloe. I've never held a gun on a human being before. Not cool. I know, Max. Really. I'm actually relieved it worked out this way instead. And there are more guns out there. Let's blow. My secret lair didn't feel secret today. At least Frank is gone. He won't fuck with us again. He just wants his money. Oh, man. Frank took Chloe's gun because of me. Wow, sir. Chloe. Why did Frank have Rachel's bracelet? We need to talk about this later, but I better follow Chloe now. Where's Chloe? Chloe's waiting to go for a walk. We both need a time out from here. Now what? I can't believe you basically gave him my gun. Here you go, Frank. You can't keep getting mad at me. Especially for stupid shit. I'm not mad. It adds up in my mind as people letting me down. And I just They're gonna get run over gun, by a man. train. Now you have me to protect you. I'm just glad you were here. Me too. I think. Chloe, why the hell are you hanging around scary losers like Frank? It's weird. Let's take a break and I'll talk. Feels like a different world, huh? I wish we could stay forever. Can we build another pirate fort and keep the world out? We need a new secret hangout. At least Frank wouldn't find us. Are you okay, Max? I'm still freaked out about what happened. That was awful, Chloe. I'm sorry. But Frank isn't as hardcore as he thinks. All he cares about is his cash, stash, and mangy dog. Chloe, are you for reals? Frank just took your gun and threatened us. He's armed and clearly dangerous. Max, I know. Crazy shit is the new normal for me. That's why I plan to leave Arcadia Bay without paying Frank off. Now, tell me exactly what's going on between you and Frank. Does huh. he have a last name? Frank Bowers, he's just a dealer, where I get my weed. 
The one in your joint, remember? Anyway, Frank and I kind of hung out. Is this your bad boy phase? No, it's my <laughs> trying to scrounge some quick cash so Rachel and I can get the hell out of your face. Frank had quick cash. That's all. That's it? No. I want to know how Frank got Rachel's bracelet. What do you think? I don't know anymore. My brain is so fried from all this. I need a mental enemy. It's so weird talking to you about this insane crap. We haven't hung out this much since we were tweens, and it's like no time has passed. I wish Rachel was here to meet you. Do you think that Rachel and I would have been friends? You're not that different. <laughs> she had has a great eye for images and for art. Plus, Did you she's just a say smart fart? Like Oh. We would all be hella best friends forever. I know she must be as cool as you are. I have no doubt we'll meet soon. Railroad tracks always make me feel better. I have no idea why. Kerouac me. It's the romance of travel and movement. The sound of the train whistle at Look night. Look at the beat poet here. I'd rather be a good photographer. You are. You just have to stop being afraid. <laughs> She's taking pictures. <gasps> oh no! She's having another nightmare. God. Ow! I forgot the clown. She's stuck. <laughs> What's that noise? <gasps> the train. Oh shit. Well, help her. Find something. Free me. <sighs> Max, you can't just yank Chloe out like a superhero. Move. I better find a tool to cut those wires. Max! I can't even move it an inch. The train's coming! Max, please! I'm hurrying, girl. I'm hurrying. Max, get me out of here! I'm trying! Something. I should rewind. <sighs> Must have missed something. I better find a tool to cut those wires. I better find a tool to cut those wires. Drum. Please get me out of here. I don't know. This looks way too heavy. And right over the switching lever. Oh. 
I'm trying to hurry, Chloe. I don't want her to die. I can't find anything. Damn, something is blocking the drum. Oh. It's that. This wedge locks the drum in place. This wedge locks the drum in place. Oh. I can't even move it an inch. The train's gone. I need to pull the switching lever right now. Max, get me out of here. I'm trying, girl. Kill me instead! I wonder how we'll get around this. I don't know how to do it! <laughs> Guys, I don't know how to do this. <laughs> Can I take this out? This wedge locks the drum in place. Come on, Max! Come Damn! On. Something is blocking the drum. <sighs> Please, get me out of here! Oh, what do I use? Ooh, take. I can definitely use this bad boy. The train's coming! Max, please! Damn, something is blocking the drum. Oh, Max, get out of here! Please! Please! Now I can finally move the drum. I'm hurrying. Now I can finally move the drum. <gasps> Freaking high! <laughs> ah, okay. Now I'm gonna have to do it all over again. Oh, wait. Do I have... Oh, no. Come on, Max. Oh, I do have it. Hurry. This wedge locks the drum in place. But wait, I don't have the thingy thing. What happened to the... Th what the hell? Oh, son of a gun. Yo, I don't have the thing. The thing's not here. Hold your tater, girl. The train. Now, Max, please. Get me out of here, Max. Please. I have to help 
Let's Chloe up. I got splinters in my ass and legs, so I wish there was a less violent way for you to save me. Guys, I almost yeah, killed her, but I saved her that time. Aren't you glad I took you away to a nice, quiet, desolate spot? It was cool to spend time in your lair, but I have to get back to school before my next class. Since you're the mysterious superhero, I'll be your faithful chauffeur and companion. My powers might not last, Chloe. That's okay. We will. Forever. No. What do you mean they will forever? <gasps> At least I saved her. Hey, we're back at school for, for the class. Ride, right on time for my art. Lesson. Thanks for coming with me. Sorry to be so boring. Nothing exciting ever happens to us, right? Listen, your rewind power has to be connected to that snow yesterday. That might explain your tornado vision. I don't see how. It's so friggin' random. Wake up, Max. You saved my life twice now. You altered the course of my destiny, yours and whoever. Do you know about chaos theory? Uh, it means shit happens, right? No, crazy shit happens. Because it can. And will. Why me? I'm just a geek girl in some small town. A perfect example of strange attractors? Don't they teach you kids anything at Blackwell? We have a tornado, rewind power, and freak snow. Hello, Armageddon. So let's party with your power, Rockstar! Like he said, Professor Price, a superhero needs a sidekick. How can it be such a shitty week and yet one of the best of my life? Because we're back in action again. I have a little time before Mr. Jefferson's class, so I can do some wandering. So are you going to that Vortex Club party? You can really learn a lot about a school by the weird shit posted on the boards. Maybe you owed money to Frank, too. I wouldn't want to be at an end-of-the-world party with Nathan Prescott. Justin always looks stoned. If I was normal, I'd be super excited about going to a major shindig. Sir? Oh. Hello, Max. I hope this isn't about the alleged gun incident. Alleged? Nathan did have a gun. Have you talked to him yet? Yes, he's deeply upset about this accusation. I don't blame him. Once I have all the facts, we'll talk. For the moment, focus on your schoolwork. I can't focus when I'm scared. Please don't say that. There's nothing to be scared of at Blackwell Academy. Our head of security is overseeing a new era of campus safety. I saw Mr. Madsen hassle Kate Marsh yesterday. Wait, wait. Do you see a pattern here, Max? Probably not the same one you see. It's very easy for you to instantly accuse people of doing terrible things. Nathan, Mr. Madsen, who's next? Now, if you'll excuse me, I have a meeting. Excuse me, Mr. Madsen? I know things got a little heated yesterday in Chloe's room. Was that really your reefer? 
No, it belonged to a friend of mine. Are you gonna bust me now, Mr. Madsen? Even I'm not that much of an asshole. And I am sorry about yesterday. I was wrong, but upset. Cannabis is not a big deal to you, but it has been to Chloe. You're a combat veteran. She's no threat to you. If I didn't care about her, I wouldn't care at all. When I was her age, I was out raising a lot more hell. She's better than that. All you kids are. So is Kate Marsh. What about Kate? You step between us at a pretty bad time. She's another matter entirely. Kate hasn't done anything wrong. Max, this isn't just about Kate Marsh. My concern is for the safety of all Blackwell students, including you. That will uh -oh. take more than surveillance cameras. It will take more than Ms. Grant and her petition to find missing students. Isn't that your responsibility as head of security? Unless you know something about Rachel Amber that nobody else does. I don't want to fight with you anymore. I don't want to fight with anyone anymore. That's all, Max. <laughs> Oh, I got a message. I still have time. Luke is always using the phone as a shield to avoid people. Juliet is laying the smack down on Zachary. Juliet is laying the smack down on Zachary. Yo, Maxwell Smart. Talk later, cool? I love how Evan is so above the Vortex Club and everything else. I'm trying, but you have to understand my position. Why? You don't understand mine. Excuse me, Max. Can you come over here? Sure. You look worried. Is everything okay? Sorry to bother you, Mr. Jefferson. I'm only bothered when you avoid turning in photos. But you know this. So what can I do for you? Just between you and me, I'm worried about Kate Marsh. That's no secret. Word on the street is that you and Kate had a little confrontation with our security chief yesterday. I stepped in between David Madsen barking all up in Kate's face about something. She doesn't deserve that. Of course not. <laughs> Mr. Madsen isn't the most gentle soul. Do you have proof he instigated the situation? My word isn't good enough? <sighs> the one time I choose not to take a picture. Always take the shot. My number one rule of photography. And Max? I promise this matter is being discussed by the faculty. I assume you know about this viral video? Kate is freaked out by all of this. She can't do homework while she's being tormented on a daily basis. What if Kate brought this on herself? She means well, but maybe she doesn't protest too much. She seems like she's holding back the truth. Have you talked to her? Yes, I talked to her on the phone today. She needs friends and support now. I just don't <laughs> want Kate Marsh to become the next Rachel Amber. Rachel Amber? Kate! What does she have to do with Kate? With all <laughs> the missing persons posters around, it's hard not to think of her. I miss Rachel too. But think about yourself, Max. Principal Wells told me about what you said happened in the bathroom. What? It did happen. Nathan Prescott had a gun in the girl's bathroom yesterday. This is a serious accusation, Max. So you don't believe me? I would never make something like this up. I hope so, Max. 
But it's easy to point fingers. If Mr. Madsen claims you might be a pot dealer as he did, should I believe him? Listen, should I... Excuse me, Madsen. Hello? Yes? Uh, hold on. I have to take this, so just go into class and I'll be there soon. Jerk. Uh huh. Sure, okay. Make me beautiful, Hayden. Bo. 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 Not now, Max. I'm contemplating shit. Control. Turn left, then right. Show me the love. How do I love Hayden? What's up, Daniel? Waiting to draw Dana after Hayden gets his paparazzi on. That's a great sketch of Dana. Daniel is the real deal. Waiting to draw Dana after Hayden gets his paparazzi on. Do you think Max will be... Better be quiet, Victoria. We have a master snitch and liar here. And paparazzi. I want that photo whore, or I get nasty. Too late. Oh, burn! Max is so fearless when she has backup. Right. Can I sit at my table now? Don't get cocky. This isn't over. In fact, shit's just starting, Max. Assholes. Okay, why is David taking photos of Kate? Now this is so wrong and weird. What up, Max? Hey, Warren. I saw Kate earlier and her eyes were puffy from crying. Kate has a lot on her plate. I didn't know what to say, and she, she didn't tell me anything. Okay, I know you love me, but if you're not in this class, beat it. Everybody else, please sit Maybe down. We have a lot to cover today, and so little time as usual. I see all the usual suspects here. Anybody seen Kate Marsh? I think everybody has seen Kate Marsh by now. <laughs> She's not feeling good. Sounds like you're giggling about a video gone viral. Maybe it involves a student, or a friend. I wonder how it would feel to have false images of yourself shot out all over the world for people to judge. It's cool that Mr. Jefferson published his own little book of... Photo tips. People need something to judge, so they never take a good look at themselves. We can thank reality TV for something. I guess Kate will miss class now. We can only blame ourselves. I'm worried about her. Speaking of participation, there are a few souls here who have yet to enter a photo in the contest. Like Max Caulfield, for example. Who I know can't wait to enter, right? I'm sure you read the syllabus like it was a Harry Potter book, so you must know today we're studying Kiro Skiro. It's cool that Mr. Jefferson published his own little book of photo tips. That beautiful word about the contrast between light and dark. The shadow play that gives photography such visual power. It's basic yin and yang. Black and white images are effective precisely because of their contrast. Although we don't technically see in my- Yo! Some crazy shit is going down at the girl's door! Zachary, do not come into my class like that ever again. Listen, everybody remain seated. Dismissed. Kate! No! 
She can't die. She can't. Not again. Not now. I have to try something. I won't be able to rewind again and again. Keep going, Max. You can do it. Yes. Oh. What are you doing here, Max? Stop. Don't come near me. Not now. It won't work. I don't have any power. Now I have to do this by myself? Max, seriously, don't come near me. I will jump. Okay, okay. I'm right here. Kate, please. Oh, Max, I know you want to help me. I love that you stepped up to David, but it doesn't matter now. Nothing matters. Don't worry, Kate. Things will get better. I promise. I do want to believe that. Kate, your life is still yours. And we can get through this together. Let me help. Like I helped by erasing all that crap people wrote on your room slate. I'm glad to hear you worry about me. That makes me feel better. Of course I worry. You're my friend, Kate. I did feel better talking to you on the phone. I always feel like you really listen. Kate, please trust me. Come stand by me, okay? I can help you now. I know I can. This morning I erased the web link to the video. It was written on the shower room mirror. That's your story now. How can I trust you? What about this morning when I needed help? You told me to do nothing. I wasn't sure what to do. There's been so much crazy shit going on. I, I can't even explain. Yeah, it's all about Max Caulfield. I can't trust you or anybody. What's the point? Wait, Kate. I'm sorry. Please, you don't have to do this. Max, I'm in a nightmare and I can't wake up. Uh, unless I put myself to sleep. Then everybody at Blackwell can post pics of my body. Morty on the internet forever. No wonder they call it a web. Nothing can ever get out. Like my video. I wish I could go back in time and erase everything. Kate, this is our chance to beat the bullies. That's the only way we can win against them. Can we really, Max? I don't believe in miracles anymore either. Now I do. You're part of the reason why. If you come down with me, I can tell you more. You're such a good person, Max. Even if you're full of crap. But I'll come with you. You're my friend. Forever. Can we hug on it? No. 
Nobody cares about me. Nobody. Your mother, your father, your brother, your sister. Wait, Kate. Think about your brothers. They need their sister. You don't know me at all, Max. I told you I only have sisters. You never listen because you don't give a damn. You will now. I can't go backwards. Kate, no! I know yeah, this I isn't just pleasant killed for Kate. Us, but we have to go over what happened before Miss Marsh. Before she did what she did. Officer Barry will be taking notes for the official police inquiry. I'm sure you'll give him your full cooperation. Such a tragedy. But there must be a reason for everything. We need to find out why Kate Marsh would be driven to such desperate action. As principal of Blackwell Academy, I take my duties seriously. I take the well-being of every student more seriously. What happened today should never happen in a hall of wisdom and knowledge. Mr. Madsen, as our head of security here, those roof doors should always be locked. That's just standard operating procedure. They were not, and that is indeed your responsibility. Mr. Jefferson? I know you can't be expected to know what your students are going through, but Kate has assisted you in class, so you should have known something was amiss. Mr. Prescott, since you are responsible for the Vortex Club parties, and since Miss Marsh did attend your last party, you'll have to answer some more questions. Miss Caulfield. Why exactly were you on the route with Kate Marsh? Did she tell you her plan? Or anything at all? Please, <laughs> tell us everything. I don't know anything! <laughs> Jefferson made her cry. Bullied her. And Nathan does her. I'm gonna say something wrong. All I know is that Kate was at a party and Nathan dosed her. She got wasted and kissed some boys on a viral video without a clue. I dosed her? <laughs> without a clue. Have you seen the video? Whatever. Kate was loaded and You're a liar. The field. You told Kate you took her to the emergency room. I said I was going to take her to the ER. She sobered up eventually. Bullshit. Something happened to her and you know it. How about we talk about you waving a gun in the girl's hey, bathroom? Hey, that's total slander. I could sue you and this school so fast. I already have a personal lawyer. Careful, Mr. Prescott. I have been told of this alleged gun incident, and I have to admit that the video in question was sent to me by multiple sources. Including me. And since Mr. Prescott does appear prominently in the video and was responsible for the party, I have no choice but to suspend him until further notice. Whatever. See you in court. Excuse me. I think Max and Nathan need a break before we grill them further. A friend and fellow student is dead. And they don't need this forum right now. Yes, I'm kind of devastated right now. I'd I'm like sad that family. Kate just right, killed Caulfield, herself. Please sign here to confirm Aww. what you've told us. I'll continue this investigation from there. My head is killing me. But Wait, I have I to sign it? I can use my power again. Sign the paper. <laughs> her head is killing her. Well, I think we know less <gasps> now than when we start. Am I gonna get her killed? We'll Am I gonna get Max killed? <laughs> I know this has been a stressful day. I wish I had the power to change it all for the better. So thank you for coming in. Now what's happening? I just can't. 
can't believe it. It's like it wasn't even real. Watching her drop like a weight. I really thought I could save her. No! Like ah! I was, I was about to cry. Room, so. Kate was on that roof for her reasons, not yours. My hand just reached out. Stop it. You were the only one with balls enough to run to the roof. You were the only one who cared. Yeah, I sure made a big fucking difference. Maybe if more people cared, better people than me. You're the best person around. Warren, I screwed up today. That makes no logical sense. Warren, I don't mean to sound weird, but there's something ominous going on at Blackwell. Today proves that. And I'm working on proof that Kate Marsh is connected to Rachel Amber. Somehow. Along with Nathan and Mr. Nelson. I'm not a big uh, conspiracy guy, uh, but I wouldn't doubt uh, it. Nathan did scare me yesterday, sorry. and Madsen is a straight-up dickhead. Oh, so, wow. what do you think is really happening? What the hell is this? The weather confirms this weird day. I feel that chill. Max, there was no eclipse scheduled today. I would know. I would. Warren. I believe anything this week. Well, that is the end of episode two, ladies and gentlemen. Um, I want to just thank everybody for watching. Um, but I was thinking. Oh.
You guys, it is time for episode... I want to finish all the episodes today. Um, so let's start right on in to episode three. In the previous episodes of Life is Strange. Whoa. We called film Little Pieces of Time. I'm so sick of people trying to control me! Don't ever touch me again, freak! It totally makes sense. You hella saved my life. I think it's awesome you set a tongue record on video. <laughs> You're going to be sorry someday. And there she is. How are you doing, Max? Hi, Joyce. I am so sorry about William. I have great memories of him. That was his gift to us. Wonderful memories. Let's talk about your superpower. Hey, Stelm and Louise, you're my business now. That's and I... Rachel's bracelet. Why the fuck are you wearing her bracelet? You want me to cut you, bitch? Please, step back. You're kidding. Put that down. Please, get me out of here! Max! Nobody cares about me. Nobody. <laughs> What are you doing here, Max? Now, I know today was difficult for everybody. Miss Coffey, why exactly were you on the route with Kate Marsh? Please, tell us everything. What the hell is this? Max, there was no eclipse scheduled today. I believe you, Warren. I'll believe anything this week. Hmm? I'm going to meet Jenny's parents and get my car back. I'm going to go for a while, so just call me if you need anything. She was taking care of Kate's bunny. Alright. I'm gonna stop the episode. Um. But I'm gonna end the episode there. Um. Whenever I come back, we'll start with the episode. We'll start with another episode. And after that next episode, I'm gonna do all. I'm gonna do those three more episodes left. I'm gonna do episode three, four, and five. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys next time. And I'll see you guys in a minute. Bye.